everyone, this is Sunglass Rob from Sport RX, and we're in beautiful Point Loma in San Diego at America's Cup Harbor. I'm with Randy. He is from Royal Star Sport Fishing. 40 years in the industry, sir. That's right. You know a thing or two about fishing and the water. That's about all I know about. And glasses. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're aboard his Trayola boat, and we're here to talk about the best fishing sunglasses of 2018. So this is like our personal choices on kind of the best stuff out there from a few different brands. And I think we're just gonna start with what what we're wearing ourselves. You mm -hmm. got on the, the Costa Cape. It's hard to talk about fishing glasses without Costa. So mm -hmm. we're gonna start, we're gonna start coast the country strong coast that's the cape that's a newer ish one it's been out of, i think about a year now yeah how have they been working for you they're perfect they're yeah. exactly what i want in a fishing glass for sure between the lenses and the wraparound frames comfort you can't beat them i would say randy's got just about a medium maybe medium inching towards large head size and i'm about large to extra large <laughs> maybe extra <laughs> extra large i got a bit do you know by chance like your hat size uh, like 10 inches, I think? No, it can't be 10 <laughs> inches. Mine's seven and five eighths. I bet you're about a seven and a quarter, seven oh, and a okay. half or so. Yeah, but I, I definitely have the like bigger head. If you have a big head, like look towards what I'm wearing. And then if you're a more average, regular guy, probably closer to Randy. What I love about the Cape is that it's a really big oversized lens, but it's not a really big oversized fit. So if you want something with a lot of coverage, really big, but you don't have a huge head, I would definitely check out the Cape. Can I try those on? Absolutely. So I think I could pull them off, but they're a little snug for me here. They're like, they don't fit my head so well, even though the lenses are so big. So like I said, if you're about a medium, medium to large, but you want that extra large kind of coverage and look, check out the cape. Man, I really like those lenses. That's yeah. the great lens. By the way, we did a whole video on how to pick out the right pair of uh, fishing sunglasses. All the information you'd ever want to hear about frames, lenses, colors, materials. So check out that video for all that goodness. All right. So that was the cape. This is the permit. I'm wearing the Costa permit. This one's a tried and true one. It's been in the roundup for a long time. Super big, super comfortable. This one's super technical too. It's got the venting, rubber all around where you need it, grip on the inside. Uh, this has got the glass lens, the blue mirror for deep water fishing. This is the permit. And again, this one is a big boy. I'm gonna have Randy try it on just so you guys can see on like a regular size human what they uh what they how they work yeah those are big i think they're almost yeah, a little big for you a little, little gap right there a little big but they're, they're comfortable yeah not bad I, I like the thought of this venting it's really cool you have yeah. it a little bit too yeah. right there yeah yeah all right let's keep going down the coast the uh, alley oh the tuna alley you see what i did there <laughs> see what i did there that's the tuna alley i have a feeling they're going to fit you probably better than me they're a little small for me i would say that's about a medium to large fit that's probably the yeah, best selling Costa out there. It's, it's got to be one of the best sellers. That yeah. one's like... This, this one fits me really well. Really, really yeah, in the like, roundup. Does mm -hmm. really well. Yeah, because I mean, we're, we're on the water working in them. So yes. you need a snug, snug fit. Yeah, that tuna. It's got all the rubber, all the grip, a little bit of extra protection on the side. I mean, mm -hmm. that thing does it. All right, let's keep going. Fantail. Um, I think the Fantail fits me kind of okay. It's actually pretty comfortable. A little bit on that kind of more... Um, Smaller look, but I think that's okay. A lot of coverage, a lot of protection, kind of fits in my eye socket really well. I kind of dig this color. I mean, look, that's kind of a Matching. perfect, oh, it might yeah. match your hat. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Oh, those are good. Yeah. I like those. Yeah, those are good. Again, with the blue mirror. And then we have another uh, runaway hit from Costa right now. This is the Rincon. And the Rincon is debatable if it should be on this table right now because it doesn't have all the features of a true hardcore pair of fishing glasses. It doesn't have that much wrap. It has a little bit of the spring hinge thing, which is comfortable, but for super hardcore fishing, this might not be your choice. But if you're looking for a really cool pair of sunglasses that you can go fishing in, that you're gonna use kind of off the boat, maybe a little bit more, like if these aren't like you're in your arsenal and you're hardcore and you're fishing all the time, but you want something that will get you by and still have that that amazing Costa lens technology, I think the Rincon, it might be a really good choice. Um, I think for me, a little bit more casual about fishing, I think they'd be fine. Uh, if I was more hardcore, I'd, I'd go with something more like the Permit, but they just look so cool. So also, if you're kind of into the aesthetics of it, I, I think like you probably wouldn't take these on a four day adventure. 
Just because of the open on the side situation. Yeah. 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 I mean, they're, they're, they're cool and comfortable and yeah. all, but yeah, that, that's, this wouldn't work for me. But, but they're selling so well but, and people are using them. We kind of thought they had to be in this roundup. All right, let's move over to Oakley. Um, Oakley's got this new one. It's called the Split Shot. This thing's brand new and it has some really cool features to talk about. One thing is um, hat fit. So put those on and you're wearing more of a curved hat. A lot of times sunglasses and curved hats kind of like fight each other for real estate. Mm -hmm. And there's a couple of millimeters of drop right there on purpose specifically. So if you're wearing a hat and it's really tucked in low and it's really bright out there, mm -hmm. that they're not fighting for that same two or three millimeters of space. So mm -hmm. that's pretty cool. They have a full wrap around, a lot of grip, uh, an unobtainium nose bridge. Unobtainium is Oakley's material. The hotter you get and the more you sweat, the stickier and tackier you get. But the real true story with this one is this integrated leash holder. Um, this opens up and it comes with the leash uh, and it hooks right in there and then you close it. So it kind of becomes part of the yeah. glasses, which is, really, is really, really cool. Really cool feature. Yeah, and I would say this is a, kind of a one size fits most. I think on me on the big head, it, it works. I think I can get away with these, they're pretty comfortable. And then on Randy, they fit perfect they fit too. Perfect. So yeah. this is a, a one size fits most. Now this pair, the double edge is not a one size fits most. This is the big boy. So if you got a big head like Rob and you're looking for some great fishing glasses, check out that Oakley double edge. By the way, Oakley's gonna have some really cool uh, lens options. This is not an actual um, uh, fishing specific Oakley lens, but these guys did. This has the deep water and then they also make a shallow water. So they make a specific lens for, for either way. But um, the smaller brother of the double edge is the drop point. Very similar pair of glasses, but that's gonna be more of about an average fit. And we actually have a video on drop point versus double edge if you want to check that out. We did a lot of videos with these glasses a while back. Yeah, that kind of fits you perfect. Yeah. A lot of coverage, a lot of wraparound. Yeah, they're nice. So that's going to be the drop point from Oakley. If you need a regular fit, if you got a big head, check out the double edge. All right. We did Costa, we did Oakley. I think we're on to Smith. I'm a huge fan of this frame. This is the guide's choice. It's got to be their best-selling fishing pair of glasses. Comes with the Chroma Pop color enhancing technology. Uh, I mean, look at it's got all this little extra mm -hmm. right there for light coming in on the nose. It's got this really good hard tension spring hinge. Usually don't like spring hinges for activities like fishing, but this one's an, an exception because it stays on so well. It's going to be a little bit of a larger fit on the bigger head, but I'm going to have Randy try it on too because I think it's another one of those one size fits a lot of people kind mm -hmm. of styles. Super comfortable too. And I really like that matte tortoise. It's kind of like sophisticated. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice those fits are kind of perfect. Yeah, they fit well. And then we have a, a, another one. This is the Chalice, which is basically a smaller guide's choice. I think on the big head, too small. And probably on Randy, they're going to be just about perfect. I'll steal those from you. Boats yeah. are rocking a little bit. I'm feeling it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, How's that feel? That feels great. Yeah. I, mean, I like these better than, than that. You like the chalice better? Yeah, yeah, yeah. they're meant for a smaller head like yours. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Okay, and now we're going to go on to Kanan. Kanan uses a really cool lens material called SR91, and recently they came out with an ultra version, which is a color enhancing tech. Really, really cool lens tech. And this is going to be the Redding, I believe, I got on. This is a little bit of the bigger one. A lot of coverage, eight base, good pair of glasses, super lightweight, and really like that matte black frame. Kind of big for you. A little bit. Kind yeah. of big for you. That's big why we yeah. also brought the Anacapa, if I said that right. I think I did. I think you're going to like these because I know you like that thick temple too. Mm -hmm. Try that guy on. These frames are made in Italy. Really good lens material. Canaan makes some good yeah. stuff. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. perfect. Yeah. I kind of like that one. All right. And then from our friends at Spy with the Happy Lens, we have the Angler. Guess what sport these are made for? Hmm. <laughs> I haven't heard of it. Yeah, this is the Spy Angler. Um, grip on the nose, grip on the temple, eight base, but still kind of, I think, I think you're not missing out anything uh, functionality, but they're a little bit dressier looking. They're a little bit kind of uh, right. lifestyle. Yeah, that's got the Happy Lens bronze, so that would be good for trying to uh, inshore spotting the kelp kind yeah. of a lens. Yeah. yeah, 
a little bit more of a contrast lens. They do mm. make a dark gray lens as well, and of course they're polarized. Mm. That frame kind of fits you just kind of perfect. Yeah, these are I don't, really I won't even try them on because I'm going to ruin them. They're, not, they're too small for me. <laughs> Stretch them out. I, I know they they are. <laughs> uh, and then of course our friends from Maui Gym have this new one called the Big Wave. Feel how light these are. They're like, yeah, that is ridiculous. it's like a micro micro lens frame technology. It's They're like, they weigh like nothing. Yeah, That's gonna be a big frame. Try it on just for fun. But the big wave is a big frame, so probably not gonna fit you too well, but probably you can tell how comfortable they are. Yeah. Yeah. It's like wearing nothing. Yeah, they're, they're like, if you have trouble, if the frames weigh on, down on your nose, if you're just, if you're sensitive to weight, or if you're out there for a really long time and you just wanna forget that you're wearing anything, this wow. is a really good one, yeah. They you good. Yeah, they're gonna fit me kinda perfect. Just like, you forget, like they're yeah. just almost not even there. And the lenses are superb uh, from Maui Gym as well. Well, that was a lot of really, really, really good sunglasses. We most likely have a video on almost every one of these frames. If we don't, uh, email us, let us know, put it in the comment section, we'll make you one. Um, this is our favorite 2018 fishing glasses, probably even going into the 2019 season. This is gonna work as well. Uh, if you have any questions on anything we talked about or anything at all, you can leave a comment in the comment section or email info at sportrx.com. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and we would love for you to subscribe subscribe to the channel. I think we're going to go inside, go to Mitch's and get some fish and chips and Sounds some fish good. tacos. <laughs> swordfish. Swordfish is supposed to be good today. All right. Later. Play.